My name is Phil Park and I'm the construction and training manager for Haygrove. We've got a A130 substrate machine. It's on a track and it's self-propelled and today we're rolling out the Profile A130 substrate gutter. When we come to farm with this machine, it will arrive on a low loader trailer through our own transport and with that we will supply a generator to power the machine and in the UK we would supply a telehandler to site from a local hire company because then we're self-sufficient and we can load the coils and just keep running. In Europe we would ask the customer to supply a telehandler or a lifting machine. When we come to site we would expect the customer to have installed all of the legs and the brackets that the gutter sits in so that we can roll the gutter continuously into the bracket. Ideal conditions for the machine to work would be either on a sleeper road like you can see we're working today or ground that is pretty firm, well drained if it's possible. Yes, we can work in the mud because it, at the time of the year that we were working, we've got quite a flat field behind us. We can work on slopes, there's undulation in it, dependent on the profile that we're running as to how it actually reacts with the slopes. We average four to 5,000 linear meters per day with this machine. The machines that have got a double drain profile in them, we can run those machines slightly quicker. So we'll be looking at between five and 6,000 linear meters a day. The coils that we use are circa 1,000 kilos. With that, depending on the width of the coil, we would be using anything from 520 to 580 linear meters per coil. Health and safety requirements on this machine is to fully understand the workings of the machine, Haygrove would supply two trained technicians with this machine. One person that's running the machine as the main operator and then the other person that walks down the field guiding gutters into and through the brackets. If we're looking at 100 metres run, we would normally look for two people from the customer to help us. We could do up to 200 metres. When we have a smaller project of less than one hectare, we would look to get the material rolled out into sections. and We would run those at about 9.2 metres per section, and then they would be transported to the customer's site where they can actually install it straight into there without having to have this machinery on site. We find it helps to keep the cost down. 